The last time I was there, I watched two guys fistfight over which Jersey Shore character was hotter. I'm a JWoww fan myself. And a girl who could have been Courtney Love's doppelganger flashed her boobs so some guy with a goatee would play Miley Cyrus's Party in the USA on the jukebox. Did you get to do a lot of blood draws? Lisa asked, and I silently wondered if this was what the next two weeks of working with her would be like. Of course, her eyes did that thing again where they lit up like someone just handed her a winning lotto ticket. I started to fear if I gave her any more excitement, she'd channel Meg Ryan and When Harry Met Sally, only this time, it wouldn't be fake. I'll have what she's having? No thank you, Lisa. But to deny her more medical pleasure felt like a sin, so I just rolled with it. Oh yeah, I answered. Blood, brains, you name it and I collected it. Her eyes popped big and wide. You collected brains? Whoops. In the name of Lisa's medical O, I'd officially taken it too far. I'm kidding. I backpedaled, and the look of relief in her eyes was evident. Just a little neuro humor. You scared me for a minute there, she said with a hand to her chest. I thought maybe this Dr. Shepard was running an unethical practice. Derek Shepard? Unethical? That's blasphemy. The man had lived his life for his career. I felt outraged for all of Seattle Grace and Shonda Rhimes. Dr. Shepard was the very best man I've ever known, I said, and my voice turned soft. Well, until he died, that is. May he rest in peace. Lisa's eyes turned gentle. He died? Yeah, I said, and I swear to God, the trauma of season 11, episode 21, hit me straight in all the feels. Terrible accident, I whispered, and had to blink back the tears. No one, and I mean no one, saw it coming.